The party controlled everything. The news media, police, the armed forces, the judiciary system, all level of education, all cultural and religious institutions. Never before has there been such absolute control. Organized resistance was practically impossible. One could not speak openly, even with close friends, never knowing whether or not they might be Nazi spies or collaborators. One day in 1942, copies of a leaflet entitled The White Rose suddenly appeared at the University of Munich. It was written in secret by students Hans and Sophie Scholl. It was time, the essay said, for Germans to rise up and resist the tyranny of their own Nazi government. Ultimately, there were six leaflets published and distributed by Hans and Sophie Scholl and their friends, four under the title The White Rose and two under the title Leaflets of Resistance. February 18, 1943, Hans and Sophie's luck ran out. They were caught leaving pamphlets at the University of Munich and were arrested for treason. The judge of the People's Court wore denunciations as if he were not the judge but the prosecutor. They were all sentenced to death. Hans Scholl was last to the guillotine.